That felt good, huh? Stay. Hey y'all, welcome to a special episode away from the Magnolia State. I'm Brandon, and this is my English Lab Willow. Recently, my wife and I decided to spend some time away from the house. So we rented a camper, loaded up the dog, and headed out to the middle All of right, nowhere. Let's stop. And as it turns out, when you don't plan a trip very well, you have to hit up the local grocery store. Luckily, All Willow's training paid off. What'd you say, Willow? Huh? You sunbathing? Yeah. All right, ready? We rented a camper and spent some time right on a lake. And swimming is one activity Willow doesn't get to do too often. In fact, I was so unsure about how she'd do, I kept her long leash on her for a while. I wanted to make sure she was a competent swimmer and would remember which way the shore was. All right, I'll do it again. Ready? Release. It didn't take me or her too long at all to realize that swimming is in her DNA. In fact, it got to a point where I could tell that she just wanted to go on a pleasure swim. Good girl. She loved being in the water, and I've got to find more opportunities to take her swimming. In fact, she was so good at it that I decided to unhook her leash and let her do what she was born to do. Heel. Okay, leave it. Release. <laughs> there she goes. Good. Well, come. And I can confidently say that recall training works in the water too. But all that swimming definitely makes a dog tired. So we all took lots of great naps on this trip. This is funny. We went into town one day and a local vendor had these toy dogs all around his cart. Willow was very interested, but she didn't break that down I put her in. Stay. But that toy dog kept getting closer, so we decided to get out of there before I was required to buy it. Here she is, cooling off and being perfect inside of a local candy store. And again, we found a nice cold piece of floor to lay on while Mama did some shopping. When we stopped for lunch, we had to find a place that would allow dogs. And luckily, Guy Fieri's place not only allows dogs, but also brings them water and ice when it's hot. What you got down there? You got some water? You got some more ice? Pink bowl. Oh, cheese bowl. We've had enough ice. <laughs> All right, you ready? Back up. There you go. All right, leave it. But what Willow really wanted to do was stop shopping and get back to the lake. <laughs> Those geese in the distance were giving Willow the side eye the entire time she was out there. All right, you. All right, you ready? Hey, you. All right, you ready? Leave it real far. Release. Welcome. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Good job. Come on. That a girl. That a girl. Good job. Good job. <laughs> more swimming always means more naps. Guys, if you want to wear out your dog, forget fetch. Take him swimming. One of our last days, we found a fantastic nature trail that allows dogs, and all of Willow's training made her a perfect pet on this trail, which at times was crowded with other people 
and other dogs. And of course, she loves staying close to the water. What in the world is that? <laughs> Check this out. The water along this trail was so clear that Willow had her first ever fish, fish sighting. Yeah, what do you think? Funny enough, the fish were just as curious of her as she was of them. <laughs> I've always trained Willow to be an off-leash dog, and all that training was rewarded on this trip. When I could, I let go of her leash, and she acted and obeyed exactly as she should. Willow, go to Mama. Guys, it's true. The more trained they are, the more freedom they have. She really is the best. Do you swim? You know swimming. She understands English. That feel good. Y'all, thanks for watching. Unfortunately, our vacation had to come to an end. But it was a blast having Willow on this trip with us. Stop for the gas, aren't we, Bill? Huh? Guys, get out and spend some time with your dog. The more you train them, the more freedom they'll have, and the more you'll be able to do together. We'll see you on the next one.